Oh, your weather forecast with meteorologist Ashley Ruiz. And a happy Tuesday morning to you. It is a beautiful one indeed. Uh, sunrise isn't for another 15 minutes or so, but we are looking very, very lovely. You can see some small high clouds in the sky off in the distance, but a beautiful sunrise indeed. 65 degrees. Some areas are sitting in the low 60s this morning. We have some lower 70s as well, but the entire area is going to warm up into the upper 80s to around 90 this afternoon. So the bottom temperature is is the actual temperature, the surface temperature, and then the, the top number, that is the feels like temperature or the heat index by this afternoon. It's going to feel like the low and mid 90s out there, thanks to increased humidity, west wind between 5 and 10. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds, a few more clouds today than what we saw yesterday, but still sunshine is going to rule the day, although we could see a few showers and storms develop. We're going to have a front just just stall itself out over the area. And then along that boundary and north of that boundary, we could see some showers and thunderstorms develop. So our rain chance today is going to be around 20 to 30 percent. There's going to be a better chance for rain the farther inland and then the farther east you are today. So the Storm Prediction Center has placed our area under a level one out of five on the scale of marginal risk for severe weather areas along and north of 10 and 12, which includes the North Shore as well. The main threat will be damaging winds, some hail, but we can't rule out a spin-up tornado this afternoon as well. We'll have to watch some of these little cells that develop later on this afternoon into the early evening, perhaps for some rotation or at least for some good wind energy. And then also we could see some heavy rain, slow moving storms, which could lead to some locally heavy rainfall, which could in turn lead to some localized flash flooding. Very isolated spots, though. We're not expecting anything widespread, but that's why rain chance is only 20 to 30 percent. Most areas will stay dry today. As for Wednesday, rain chances increase to 40 to 50 percent, 40 percent on Friday, and then 40 to 50 percent, maybe even higher on Saturday and into Sunday. We're going to have to watch that. I'll up the rain chance once confidence begins to grow a little more. But in the meantime, it does look like um, Memorial Day weekend may be a wet one at times. It's not going to be a washout, so you don't have to worry about that. But going forward into today, again, we'll see mostly sunny, partly cloudy skies by the afternoon, most likely going to see some good cloud cover this afternoon. And then after 4 o'clock, that's when I do think a few showers and thunderstorms will start to develop. And again, those will have to be watched closely for some strong to severe storm development. As for our Wednesday, starting off mostly dry, although I do think we'll start to see showers and storms pop up tomorrow morning and the evening. But again, not going to be a washout. We'll just see scattered showers and thunderstorms. As for temperatures, the next several days, upper 80s, lower 90s, except for Wednesday with higher rain chances, all the way through Memorial Day, a high near uh, 86, but this weekend, upper 80s to around 90. So be sure to keep the umbrellas on hand. Think of Plan B should any thunderstorms find you this weekend. Let's get a check on the traffic.